What's so the situation open? verdict? Um, piss poor right Whole now. Piss poor. <laughs> yeah, we're going back to Whole Foods. We need more snacks. <laughs> Chloe's just blown over. This is why the road is closed. Semi trucks and French women are just blowing over left and right. Good thing they have proper shoes. This is alpinism, basically. <laughs> Guys, you know what this means? We finally found a geological feature! Ah. Ah. We just decided that we're gonna actually just stay in Colorado for like three more days. Okay, we made it back to Cece's house where we started this morning. Did a number on the car. It was pristine we're when gonna, we started. We're but... clean it <laughs> and tomorrow we'll get after it again climbing in Colorado. Part two. <laughs> search of this V17 project that Drew's been working. Just figured we'd go check it out, but this is the trail. It's a bit heinous. So we have um, decided it is no longer worth. <laughs> Dude, it's like a blizzard right now. It's snowing so insanely hard. It's nuts. Oh! <laughs> Bryce lost his keys when he fell. It's yeah, a pretty successful fun. little rest day. Oh, it's fun. Nice little Very coffee shop action. Fortunate. Were they actually just in the snow? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Pro tip, don't let your keys fall out when you're in El Dorado Canyon sliding on snow. Oh, I for sure should have closed the door. Oh. All right, we're going to Inglewood, do some boaters and sport climbing, and then and then maybe a double sesh later on, but we will see. Oh, the Euro's got it. The Euro's got it. I can select my opponent. You're up. I can select it as an Olympian. Oh. That's who I'm. Chris Cosser? Oh. Beat him, Ross. Go, 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 go.
Come on, Quinn. Just finished up the sport sesh. Got on all the, the hard ones. Nobody should be able to tell you're pumped, even if you are. If you look pumped, then you're gonna get even more pumped. So basically yeah. fake it till you make it. Yeah. Just because you start to feel fatigued. Like if anything, that's a cue that you should climb even more efficiently. <laughs> On siding hard sport climbs is basically just like decision making and problem solving under physical pressure. So if you can stay composed, stay decisive, stay creative, that's what it's all about. It's always worth taking the extra 30 minutes to make sure you're actually warmed up well and you're not gonna get flash pump because that'll make the rest of your session so, so much better. All right, we're ending the rope session with some mobility and thoracic extensions. I got these from Kevin at the Climb Clinic. He's a really good PT out here in Colorado. Try to get it so all the bend is coming from your thoracic, not your low back. Yeah, that looks better. Yup, nice. Now you can get that nice thoracic extension. Whoa. Climbers really need to open up this upper spine. Sport clubbing reflections. Um, got really, really pumped. What did I learn today? Yeah, it's always a good question. I don't know. Oh no. I learned that trying hard isn't always a given. Sometimes it's hard to try hard. And I think you gotta to expect to be able to try hard like third bolt. Cause it's easy to try hard when you're second to last bolt and you're like, I see those anchors, gotta yeah. get there. But sometimes third bolt, it's like. That's when it counts. It all adds up. So. Lovely reflections. Big lessons today. Any good reflections? Please open the car. <laughs> now we're going to Kat's second sesh. Tomorrow morning, we're gonna head back to Salt Lake City, finally but it's been a good time. Apart from only bringing clothes for two days, so we're stinking up the gyms a little bit, I gotta say, but. Only one person's complained. All right, we're in the, the cat's dungeon. First time in here, this place is sick. This is the spray wall. So much history here, and there's no like log book or app for climbs, you just, you just have yeah. to know. The only thing they told us at the front was watch out for little gymnastic girls running across the the like lane because they're just going to take you out apparently that's the hierarchy here it goes like daniel pro woods and pro yeah, climbers and then vicious eight-year-old gymnastic girls nice oh that looks much better than what i did <laughs> yep. nice dude bryce can you explain some history for us all right so rob who's somewhere in here built this wall a long time ago Basically, like a bunch of really strong Colorado boulders have got strong on this wall. Yeah, like yeah. all of them. Yeah, all pretty much. Them. Yeah, and what like a bunch of climbs in here are trainers for like famous climbs in the park. I heard a bunch of climbs in the park are actually trainers for the climbs That's, in here. No, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> you. Come on, Chris. Ah, oh, Lily. Yeah, Ross. Oh. Come on, Bryce. Yes, dude. Nice. You got it. Oh, Ali, Ali, Ali. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, Bryce. Yo. Sick, dude. some FPV action of how you warm up the foot tensions for this move. Honestly though, I think that's a very <laughs> under warmed up area that people miss a lot is like heel hook tension and like towing in tension. So it's like always important to do some of these. All you have to do is control this hole for three seconds. And apparently there was like a $200 bounty on it. Let's go Ross. Alright Chris, let's see it. Oh my god, oh. oh! Come on! Beautiful. Yeah, yeah, come on Ross, come on Ross, come on Ross, come on Ross. 
Ali, Ali. Oh my. <laughs> Yo, big time, dude. Come on, dude. Get some. Yes, dude. Nice, Chris. Come on. Let's go, dude. You know, you know, you know. Come on, bud. He just suggested that I heel hook. <laughs> He's gotta go. <laughs> climbs have you. like you have to follow like the specific sequence of a climb. Okay. So like certain climbs you can match, certain ones you can't. Like. You can basically make like any contrived rules you want. And you just have climb. to know? Yeah. <laughs> but like people will give you looks if you're doing it wrong. Because <laughs> everyone just knows all the moves and rules. Yeah, basically. Let's go, Bryce. Come on, you know. Come on, Bryce. Ah, Lily. Yo. This is serious stuff. You could use this as a weapon if you needed to. <laughs> this is straight metal. You could remove car paint with this. Honestly. <laughs> yeah. We're making some hybrid trampo, trampo spray wall boulders. Alright dude, good sesh. Yeah, that thanks was for the sesh. boulders and the mixes. Yeah, that was very fun. Super fun. Solid way to end the Colorado trip. Definitely gonna have to come back and do some more of this. We have a seven and a half hour drive, and then we'll be back in Salt Lake. It's properly cold in the car. We're gonna get to Salt Lake with like four frozen corpses in the back. <laughs> We're but literally following the scent of coffee. You can spot it, you can spot it. It's just here on the ride. We're like a quarter mile away. Is it his? Yeah, it's, yeah. Chris's nose is actually comparable to that of like a bloodhound when it comes to coffee. When it comes to coffee, I can get it every time. What kind of beans are they roasting? Um, whiskey aged barrel. Wow. They've been like aged in these whiskey barrels, so like mad side, you just <laughs> smell it in the air. All right, Chris is just typing coffee roasters in Google Maps. And, and here we are. Now we're literally just waiting for a fresh roast to come out. This is the best pro tip actually I've, I've ever given, is when you're looking for a coffee shop, instead of just typing in a coffee shop, you type in coffee roasters into Google Maps or Apple Maps or whatever, and that immediately narrows down all the places so you only get the most, the most legit shops. And that's how we ended up here. They don't actually sell coffee, so we're just we're waiting for beans now. Love's gas station is really 10 out of 10. Comment if you've ever seen a piece of, Comment if you know what that is actually, and then 
What is it? We don't know. An end dive. An end dive. Mm -hmm. Oh! Oh! Yes. You! 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 <laughs> We're only like three hours away from Salt Lake City and they literally just closed the roads due to high winds, so we're heading back to Colorado. <laughs>